A New York state judge rejecting former President Donald Trump's request to delay the New York State Attorney General's quarter-billion-dollar civil fraud trial. Judge Arthur Ingeron, responding in a one-sentence handwritten order, declined to sign. Defendants' arguments are completely without merit. That trial now set to begin in less than a month. We are filing a lawsuit against Donald Trump for violating the law as part of his efforts to generate profits for himself, his family, and his company. New York Attorney General Letitia James suing Trump, his eldest sons, and the Trump Organization, alleging Trump executives and others inflated his net worth by billions in some years in an effort to lock in better terms on loans and insurance. Trump and the other defendants have denied any wrongdoing. In New York City, another legal blow. Federal Judge Lewis Kaplan setting January 15th, 2024 as the trial date for a former magazine columnist E. Jean Carroll's second defamation suit against Trump. Carroll accused Trump of raping her in a Bergdorf Goodman department store dressing room in the 1990s and then defaming her after she went public with the claim. In May, a jury found Trump liable for sexual misconduct and defamation against Carroll in the first lawsuit, awarding her $5 million in damages. It's the most ridiculous, disgusting story. It was just made up. Carol then filed suit against Trump again, alleging he defamed her in a 2022 statement. Carol's second defamation suit against Trump is now set to begin the same day as the 2024 Iowa Republican caucuses, a critical date for Trump, who now holds commanding leads in polls of Republican presidential candidates. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington. Just